What's up everybody, Coach Hoppy here with workout one for Memphis's most fun fitness competition that is waterlogged. So what we're gonna do here is just walk through the workout. I'll walk through the standards for each one and understand the flow a little bit better so you guys know what to expect uh, day of. So starting out, you're gonna start out with 100 dumbbell step overs, and then you're gonna do your water shuttle and then a 200 meter dumbbell run. This will be for time. There's gonna be a 20 minute cap On this workout. So the way it'll start, three, two, one, go. You and your partner will be standing on opposite sides of a plyometric box and you'll be holding one dumbbell. You can hold the dumbbell anywhere below your shoulders, meaning you have to hold it like a farmer carry. We can't hold it up on the body. No part of the body or your shirt or anything like that can support the dumbbell. So it'll always be in the hanging position and you'll just use one hand to hold it at all times. From there, I would step up onto the box with both feet and then step down on the opposite side of the box. Once my second foot hits the ground, then that would be one rep. My goal is to complete 100 reps with my partner. So you can split them up however you like, whatever that looks like. That is what the dumbbell step over is gonna look like and those are the standards. Each division, the box just gets shorter and the weight gets lighter. So that's what we're looking at for the dumbbell step over. So once you have completed all of the dumbbell step overs, 100 is completed, the dumbbells go back on the box, and then we move to the water shuttle. So there'll be two buckets. There'll be a Home Depot bucket on one side, and then the Home Depot bucket on the other side filled with water. You'll start out, you'll each have a small cup, and you'll run down, fill up with water, and then run back and pour it into this bucket. The goal is to get the water from bucket A into bucket B. There'll be some distinct lines on the bucket for your division. Your goal will be to fill the bucket to the level of your division <clears throat> and it'll be clearly marked. You'll be working one person at a time, just like we were on the dumbbell. Once you are done shuttling the water and all of the water or your water up to your line is in bucket B, you will then move on to the 200 meter dumbbell run. You'll grab your dumbbell. Each of you now will be working at the same time. You'll grab your dumbbell and we're gonna do a lap around the building. We're gonna stay off the sidewalk and go around all of the curbs. So it'll be one lap. The time ends, workout one ends, when you and your partner get back and both dumbbells are on top of the box where they started. Again, on the run, same standard as on the step over. You have to carry the dumbbell in a hanging position. It cannot be supported by your body or any other part of you or your costume if you're dressing up. Uh, it must be held in your hand and one hand at a time. You can't hold on to it with both. That's what we're looking for for workout one. Let me know if you have any questions or issues. Please ask us sooner rather than later. All right, can't wait to see you guys out there. Thanks.